The Lost, Millennia of Knowledge, Level 80, Cogshin Highway, Survival Difficulty, Class 0, Safe, Secure, Devoid of Native Entities. Level 80 is the 81st level of the back rooms. Image Caption, An Image of Level 80's Road. Description, Level 80 is an endless two-lane highway that stretches in both directions and loops back in on itself after a certain amount of time. Footnote, Looping refers to one's return to their starting point. See Meg Exploration Log 080-A. And footnote, the furthest the highway has looped, footnote, one loop is measured by the distance traveled before reaching a set mark, and footnote, is recorded at 13.3 kilometers, 8.26 miles, footnote, as of 10 22 2021, and footnote, traveling further is possible but unlikely. The highway is located in a cold desert basin with no other human infrastructure in sight. Entering from the highway, a Himalayan mountain range will be visible to the left. Its distance from the road is estimated to be around 40 kilometers, 25 miles. If you have entered from the desert, the mountain range will instead be on the opposite side of where you arrived. It is unclear how this phenomenon works. The desert itself is barren and incredibly dry. It cannot host any type of flora, fauna, or anomalous entities. Entities that have been encountered at this level originate from other levels, such as hounds and skin stealers, although these are extremely rare due to the level's conditions. No native entities have been documented. The level has no daylight cycle and is locked into a permanent daytime. Despite this, temperatures in this level can range from 1.2 degrees Celsius, 34.2 degrees Fahrenheit, down to negative 26.5 degrees Celsius, negative 15.7 degrees Fahrenheit. Changes in temperature can happen at random, but last no more than a few hours, too short a window for these changes to be recorded. The volume of oxygen in this area is also excessively high and can potentially cause sickness if you are exposed to it for an extended period of time. After traveling for at least 3 kilometers, 1.86 miles, you will eventually come across an abandoned settlement. A nearby signpost denotes its name, pronounced Nejdal. The word was painted onto the sign with an unidentifiable red substance. Footnote. Scraps have been taken by the Meg and tests are being run to identify the substance, but none so far have been conclusive. End footnote. It appears that there is writing underneath the paint, but it cannot be read due to the obfuscation. The settlement consists of a large yurt and several caravans scattered around. Three decomposing corpses have been retrieved from the yurt, along with around 40 skeletal remains, which were gathered around the general area. Various containers can be found inside the yurt and the surrounding caravans, with most of them being either empty or holding valuables or personal belongings. Recovered artifacts vary in age, ranging from around the 12th century up to the 1980s. Most of these artifacts can be traced back to Central Asia in the front rooms. Bases, Outposts, and Communities There are no known bases, outposts, or communities on this level. Entrances and Exits Entrances The main way to enter is by going through level 9 and finding a road that appears slightly more dry compared to the others. Following an offshoot of level 125's road is another way to enter this level. Taking the right path in level 410 will lead to this level. It is also possible to get a glimpse of level 80 while traveling on level 50's road. Halting while getting a glimpse will guarantee entry into the level. It is also possible to stumble onto level 80 from any desert level. It is also possible to reach this level by following the signs in level 11 that read desert at x kilometers slash miles. 
Footnote. This information is entirely speculative due to the entrance above. End footnote. Should you continue from level 9 on the road without halting once for 800 meters, half a mile, you will reach either level 125 or return to level 9. The same can be done from level 125 to level 9. Staying on the road also has the chance to bring you to level 150. Footnote. Only two reports of this occurrence have been documented. In footnote. Going off-road for a few miles is an easy way to go to level 46. Going off-road for exactly 50 kilometers, 31.07 miles, without looking away from the highway may bring you to level 205. Going towards the mountain range will eventually bring you to level 93. Image Caption Close-up picture taken of mountain range. Addenda Show Meg Exploration Log 080-A. The log below is an audio transcription of Meg Exploration Log 080-A. The log was recorded by Meg Operative Sabrina Lee, who is accompanied by Meg Operative Sky Wilkins. Meg Exploration Log 080-A 05-17-2019 Begin Log Sky so, this is level 80. Sabrina, are you surprised? There's not much to this level. Sky, I'm going to begin setting up an outpost here. Footnote, the outpost mentioned was dismantled several days after the recording. And footnote, how about you? Sabrina, I'll be walking down this highway if you need me. Sky, oh, but what if it'll lead you to another level? Sabrina, that's what I'm going to try and find out. Sky. Right then. See you in a while. Sabrina. Farewell. Several minutes of silence. Sabrina. I've been walking on this road for a few minutes and I already feel like it's been ages. This isn't any special highway. I've walked farther in other levels. Several more minutes of silence. Sabrina. Huh? Is that Sky's outpost? Around two minutes of silence. Then... Faint footsteps. Sabrina. Sky, is that you? Sky. Huh? A moment of silence. Sky. Wait, Sabrina? Didn't you go that way? Sabrina. I did. This is likely another non Euclidean level. Sky. Okay, nothing unusual then. Should I try going that route as well? Sabrina. And last time we talked, you were worried that the road would lead to another level. Sky. Don't blame me for that. Stay here, or just go over there for now. Sabrina. Sure. A few minutes of silence. Sabrina. This level is making me feel old. More silence follows. Sabrina. I can see sky in the distance, which means that this level does have a non-Euclidean geometry. It seems like going along the road in one direction will lead to the same place you started from, but I don't have a way to record how long it takes you. I'll end the log here. We'll return to base shortly. End the log. Show BNTG records log. The table below encompasses the number one records of level 80 loop percent as found in BNTG's Trader's Keep. Visit the Trader's Keep for more information on the leaderboard. Any new submission is forwarded to and processed at the base. Below is a guide on how to record an attempt, or quote-unquote, run. Show BNTG Level 80 Recording Guide. Required Setup. Three days worth of food and water, preferably almond water. A large landmark, preferably a large flag consisting of a singular color. A timer, pedometer, or odometer. A body cam with at least 8 gigabytes of free storage. This will be provided if unaffordable. A secondary person as a recorder. Preferably a BNTG verifier. Steps. Step 1. Enter the road of level 80 with a trusted BNTG verifier or verified unaffiliated person. Step 2. Place down the significantly large landmark. Step 3. 
Verify you have all of your supplies packed and begin traveling by your method of transportation. Step 3-A. If using a timer, go at a constant speed that you are most comfortable with. The timer will be held by the recorder, and a pedometer or odometer will be in the hands of the runner. Step 4. After an undetermined amount of time, you'll reach the landmark. Halt when you are aligned with it and stop the recording device. Step 5. The stationed recorder will escort you to the nearest safe level with a BNTG outpost. Rules slash guidelines. 1. The run will not be added to the leaderboard if any part of the guide is not followed or is circumvented by suspicious means. 2. If a second attendee unaffiliated with the BNTG arrives, a background check must be performed on the mentioned attendee so as to verify that they are not affiliated with or helping the runner in any way that may be deemed as quote-unquote cheating. 3. After the findings in Event Log 080-B, we will no longer allow runners to attempt a run more than six times a week. 4. Any additional measures may be added in the future. All entries on the following table will have their information listed in the order of Name of Recorder Breaker, followed by Method of Transportation, followed by Distance Traveled, followed by Date of Recording. All entries marked with a dagger symbol exist prior to the existence of the leaderboard and cannot be verified as accurate. Sabrina Lee, Dagger Mark, Walking, 1 Kilometer, 05 slash 17 slash 2019. Sky Wilkins, Dagger Mark, Walking, 1 Kilometer, though this is highly unverified, 05 slash 17 slash 2019. Jude Barnes, Dagger Mark, Walking, 2 kilometers, 01 slash 15 slash 2020. Ryu Tuskino, Dagger Mark, Bicycle, 4 kilometers, 09 slash 20 slash 2020. Ryu Tuskino, Bicycle, 4.6 kilometers, 09 slash 26 slash 2020. Marie Lorenz, Bicycle, 5.26 kilometers, 10 slash 02 slash 2020. Ryu Tuskino, Bicycle, 5.72 kilometers, 10 slash 05 slash 2020. Stefan Dayton, Bicycle, 6.34 kilometers, 10 slash 20 slash 2020. Ilva Balus, Walking, 7.1 kilometers, 12 slash 05 slash 2020. Katie Sion Co. Walking, 7.22 kilometers, 12 slash 07 slash 2020. Joel Recto. Walking, 7.24 kilometers, 12 slash 08 slash 2020. Samuel Montes. Bicycle, 7.75 kilometers, 12 slash 08 slash 2020. Lion Hayes, walking, 8.18 kilometers, 12 slash 09 slash 2020. Lion Hayes, walking, 8.6 kilometers, 12 slash 12 slash 2020. Ryu Tuskino, bicycle, 9.93 kilometers, 12 slash 14 slash 2020. Ilva Balus, walking, 10.67 kilometers, 12 slash 17 slash 2020. Mika Yamasaki, bicycle, 10.7 kilometers, 12 slash 19 slash 2020. Ray Owen, bicycle, 10.78 kilometers, 12 slash 22 slash 2020. Samuel Montes, bicycle, 10.9 kilometers, 02 slash 13 slash 2021. Ari Texan, bicycle, 11.46 kilometers, 03 slash 26 slash 2021. Ryu Tuskino, bicycle, 11.87 kilometers, 05 slash 10 slash 2021. Marcelo Vargas, 
bicycle, 12.6 kilometers, 07 slash 11 slash 2021. Marcelo Vargas, bicycle, 12.9 kilometers, 09 slash 04 slash 2021. World record, Ari Texan, bicycle, 13.3 kilometers, 10 slash 22 slash 2021. Show Meg Event Log 080-B. Meg Event Log 080-B. Type, Person, May 10th, 2021. Several minutes after the submission of a record, BNTG member Ryu Tuskino suddenly fainted. A medical examination went underway thereafter, and Ryu was advised against recording any other runs in the foreseeable future. Medical profiling has proven several anomalies that were found in his physical health, such as rapid hair loss, rapid fingernail growth, loss of weight, and dryness of the skin and mouth. A comparison of height between profiles in February and May proves that he seems to have shrunk two inches in height. Ryu has also been diagnosed with arthritis days after the incident. When asked if he was stressed during his runs, Ryu denies the statement, citing that he, quote, never overworked himself, end quote. Show letter from the lost. Below is a letter received from the lost after the discovery of the level. It appears that you have found the aging path. It was a secret we had kept long hidden, removing it from our history. But alas, it came back to haunt us. We helped the Ancient Ones settle this place, not knowing what it could do. Even a part of us you never knew settled here. It was a grave mistake of ours. Do not make the same mistake as us, lest you face death once more after so long. Attempts to contact the Lost regarding the level after the letter was sent have failed, and any attempt to bring it up to them in regular conversation will only result in either the topic being evaded, or the Lost member in question seemingly not knowing what exactly has conspired in the level.